And I knew it was coming and I stepped on the kid's foot. I fell. I mean, it hurt, but I knew I was like, I knew I got to get up and make this pass. The return of the biggest player in college basketball. If you are someone who follows college basketball closely, the name Connor Williams may already be familiar to you. However, even if you are not particularly well versed in the sport, there is a good chance that you would recognize Williams due to his towering height of seven feet and his impressive weight of 360 pounds. So, who is Connor Williams? Who is this seven foot, 360 pound guy who drops threes like Steph Curry? Let's dive deep and get to know more about Big Cozy. Who is Connor Williams? Connor Williams, also known as Big Cozy, is an imposing figure in every sense of the term. He's definitely bigger than you, and he's probably better than you too. Williams is a force to be reckoned with on the field. Currently playing as a sophomore for St. John Fisher College, a Division III college basketball team based in Rochester, New York, Williams is consistently dominating his opponents with his size and superior passing abilities. It is safe to say that if you're going up against Williams, you'd better bring your A game. It should come as no surprise that Big Cozy was a talented two-sport athlete in high school, participating in both football and basketball. He excelled on the football field as a lineman, towering over his opponents and making them look like mere children in comparison. Despite his success in football, Williams ultimately chose to pursue D3 basketball in college rather than D2 football. Over the course of three years, he was a dedicated member of the varsity football program and a four-season participant on the varsity basketball squad. Williams' impressive athletic abilities earned him the title of Monroe County D1 Player of the Year in 2021 and helped lead his teams to victory in two Monroe County Division I League championships. In addition, he was also honored with the All-Greater Rochester selection in both 2020 and 2021. Despite having a natural aptitude for football, there was something about basketball that just seemed to run in his veins. When the opportunity presented itself for him to play basketball at the collegiate level, he knew he had to take it. And it turns out, he was quite skilled on the court. He had a surprising amount of agility and a smooth shot around the rim, but what really set him apart was his exceptional ability to pass the ball. It is rare to see a man of his size, who used to play on the offensive line for a football team, excel in basketball, but that's exactly what he did. In 2021, Williams had the opportunity to make his national television debut while playing against the Buffalo team. College basketball fans all over the United States were amazed by Williams' impressive physical abilities, considering his towering height and impressive size. Although the Cardinals were ultimately defeated by the Division I University of Buffalo, Williams' performance still managed to draw praise and attention on social media. In particular, a single redemption play that he executed during the game captured the hearts of the American public and became a viral moment, showcasing his moment of greatness. As the game progressed and we reached the middle of the second quarter, Williams was tasked with inbounding the ball from the baseline. As he brought the ball up the court, he followed his point guard's lead, but as he reached the far end of the logo, disaster struck. It appeared that Williams accidentally stepped on his opponent's foot, and as a result, he lost his balance and fell to the ground. Not everyone with his size will rise after that fall, but despite rolling his ankle in the process of the fall, like a true warrior, the youngster got up to deliver a beautiful pass while in visible discomfort. He made his way to the top of the arc and had the ball passed in his direction that even Nikola Jokic would be proud of. Despite experiencing significant discomfort while playing, Williams managed to deliver an exceptional pass over the defense to his teammate Daniel Cook. Cook successfully caught the ball while running, took a few steps, and powerfully dunked the ball in the hoop, earning an additional foul in the process. The entire sequence, including Williams' fall, recovery, and precise pass, as well as Cook's impressive dunk, was executed flawlessly. In that game against Buffalo, he had two assists and no turnovers in his four minutes. Throughout his freshman year, Big Cozy consistently contributed to his team's success, averaging 2.8 points and 2.4 rebounds per game, while playing an average of 6.7 minutes per game. Right. I think getting non-conference games, nobody wants to play it. Yep. Yeah, he's grimacing, you can tell. But he'll make the nice pass for the dunk and the foul to Cook. Big Cozy's return. 
Now, as a sophomore center for Division III St. John's Fisher University, he's back in action again this season. But with his newfound fame, he's been dubbed the nickname Big Cozy. Earlier this month, he had another opportunity to appear on national television, facing off against the Buffalo team once again. As you can recall, this is the team that had previously brought him into the national spotlight in 2021, making it a particularly significant matchup for him. And boy, he made a name for himself yet again. Despite his impressive size, Williams has a hidden talent for sinking three-point shots with the same ease as basketball superstar Stephen Curry. Take a moment to observe the incredible range displayed by Big Cozy. Not only does he have impressive physical abilities, but he also possesses a high level of intelligence and strategy on the court. With quick movements and precise aim, he deftly maneuvers the ball and resets his position for a perfect shot. And when he finally releases the ball, it soars through the air and lands with a satisfying splash in the net. This is modern basketball at its finest, and he exhibits all of the grace and skill that makes the sport so exciting to watch. Uh, Fisher team and Coach Mike Rosadonia who grab a lot of talent, and they make it all jive. They make it work. Oh, the three from the big guy! It's not that I'm trying to disrespect Shaquille O'Neal or anything, but let's be real here. We all know that he wasn't exactly known for his three-ball shooting abilities. I mean, come on. There's no way he could have hit a shot like that. Even though the Cardinals were heavily defeated by the Bulls with a final score of 91-53, to everyone was excited to see Big Cozy back on the court. Not only did he manage to rack up six rebounds and two assists, but he also contributed a total of three points to the game. Despite the team's loss... It was a memorable night for fans who were excited to see their favorite player back in action. Even though Big Cozy has not been playing sports for very long, he has shown an incredible amount of potential in his athletic abilities and career. In addition to this, he has a strong work ethic and a true passion for what he does. His hard work and dedication to the game inspire not only his teammates, but fans and spectators alike. When asked how he received the nickname Big Cozy, Connard shared the following explanation. I got the nickname at the start of the basketball season, and people just liked it. I think it's funny, and my family and friends liked it, so I figured that was the one to go with. But when you just see him, you start to realize why he is really called Big Cozy. During the interview, he was also asked to talk about his mindset and approach to situations, and this is what he had to say. When I was younger, even up until now, I never liked playing with people who wouldn't pass the ball. It's always frustrating whether you're the worst player or the best player when you ball hog. It frustrates everybody on the team. Although it is difficult to predict exactly what lies ahead for Big Cozy, it is clear that his strong work ethic will serve him well in the future. It is likely that his dedication to his craft will lead to a bright and successful future for him. Let me know what you think the future holds for Big Cozy. Will he continue keeping up his fantastic play and finally play in the NBA? Let me know in the comments below. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Enjoy your day, everyone, and thanks for watching.